PCMikeTV.com right here with Steven Espinoza. Steven, how you doing today, brother man? I'm good. I'm good, Mike. Late at night, uh, Javante Davis, headline tonight in Washington, D.C., Capital One Arena. He got a 10th round stoppage, I believe. Um, what did you think of the stoppage? Did you think he was stopped prematurely? Did you think he was... Nah, Hector I mean, was... look, you, you heard Hector after the fight. He didn't know where he was. Couldn't see, you know, and, and you know, he made the right decision. You know, there's no shame in that. Right. You know, it was a tough fight. You know, that's what everyone expected. Anybody who knew anything, you know, 400 amateur fights, tall guy, lefty, tough guy. It was going to be a scrap. But, look, you never want to rely on the power. Right. But when you have that power, you right. can change the game in one to two punches. Sometimes people don't know what the brain is doing inside. Sometimes, you know, you may go blind. You may be blinking repeatedly. Yeah. You never can tell. Yeah. How big is the star of Javante Davis? Look, I mean, we've seen it. Um, you know, let's, let's go down the list. Baltimore, Atlanta, L.A., Brooklyn, D.C., Sell out, sell out, sell out, sell out. Record breaking attendance, record breaking attendance. This will be the biggest, you know, the biggest gate that this this place has done in quite a while. Compare him to Sugar Ray Leonard, 1980. 1980, Sugar Ray was, was able to get $10 million. Does Tank deserve that type of money? Is he Look, on the same level? He's, as doing, he's doing record breaking gates. You know, he's uh, in Barclays Center, he's got the top five gate of all time of any kind of event. You know, we haven't tallied all the numbers, but when we get to it, I guarantee this is going to be one of the top gates here. So look, there are very few fighters. You can count the number of fighters that are doing what Tank's doing on one hand. Mm -hmm. I mean, you're talking about the Errol Spences, the Canellos. Those are the guys who are, you know, selling out arenas, doing, you know, big, big gates. Right. Those are the only guys in, in the U.S. who are doing stuff like that. So he's in very rare company. Right. One last one. Jerron Ennis for a good opponent tonight. Karen, um, very, very good opponent. You know what I'm saying? Fast, twitch muscles, pivoting head movement. Um, did a lot of the fans and media, you think they kind of overlooked Karen? Well, you know, um, it's not that it was overlooked. He's just got a tough style. Like, he's he's obviously very experienced. He's very technical. He didn't give Boots a lot to work with, you know, and I'm not going to say he runs. I'm not going to say, you know, that, but he certainly wasn't trying to engage, and it's tough to do something against someone who doesn't want to engage. Right. All right. Thank you, Steven. You got it, bro. All right.